You probably saw the title of this video. And yes, I had the idea of making something small and something easy that you guys can actually follow as well. So it's a little tutorial and it's just a little bit of fun. Maybe you can spot it, but as you can see, actually everything is way more crisp. Everything is way more, way better in quality and I can look far, far further uh, beyond than before. Uh, because actually my render distance is up as well as all the other settings actually almost everything is just maxed out and why because i have a new computer it's actually the first time that i have my own desktop i always used a laptop so all my other videos were made on my laptop and that laptop is well really quite old <laughs> i think it's from 2014 or 16 one of those two so yeah, it's a pretty old laptop and I'm so glad I changed it to a better desktop. So this is my new computer. I've been working on it as you can see. So yeah, uh, don't look at my desk. It's a temporary desk, but yeah, this is my new computer. But of course, uh, whenever you have a new computer, you have to reinstall everything. I had to reinstall the shader pack, Minecraft itself, all the other games. I had to install <laughs> literally everything. So, sorry it took a little while and I'm still not done. I still need to make the replay mod that I use for those cinematic shots and videos of time lapses and stuff. So, I can't really do that. So, I thought, you know, maybe you can make something small so that's what we are going to do today uh, as you can see i already laid out some blocks and i also i also am in uh, 1.17 so we have these new blocks and i've never used them before so i'm really qu quite uh, curious how i can use these blocks and maybe as main block as well and yes today i want to make a tiny house not just a tiny house and really really tiny house as small as possible so sit back and relax and let's start. Okay, give me some space here. So my first of my idea was to make an entrance used with uh, trapdoors. And as a lot of people already know, if you place a trapdoor like this, uh, not like this, like this, you stand under it and you can actually crawl underneath the trapdoor. So that's what I want to use as my uh, actual uh, front door so let's let's build something so this will be the main entrance yes i know it's nothing really special but i really like it so this will be the max height probably like this is just what three block three and three and a half blocks there's nothing <laughs> normally that just three, three blocks is the minimum of having uh, a normal like the first first floor of your house and this has to be two floors in just three blocks so the way we are going to enter ent uh, enter the house is by using the trapdoors and now you can like crawl through so that's a good idea now let's see how big we can actually make it so so while building this i uh, want to actually mention that um, because i have a new computer i have also some other games that i really want to play and maybe want to uh, play on youtube so what do you guys think of, of me playing some different games than minecraft would you like to see that or would you just want me to see of want to see me playing minecraft all the time i have made a video about roblox uh but yeah i don't know what you guys want so let me know i think this is for like one side a pretty good start and then maybe like this Maybe one up? No, no. I, I want to. I want to keep it so as small as possible. So let let's let's keep it like this, and then this will be the roof, I guess. Something like this. Yeah, that's that's alright. That's alright. Let's okay. Let's uh, keep on going. So we have a little elevation over here, and maybe I want to make one elevation uh, around this place. Let's see this is the top then yeah that looks good and then we will push push this all the way over here so this will be connected 
Yeah, that's all right. That's all wait. No. Hmm. Yeah, that's. I don't know if I like that. I don't know if I like to see this white. For some reason. Let me try something. Let's just delete this for now. Keep it away. That's already better. Uh, maybe not this wood. I, I, I was just trying out a little bit of detail. Uh, let's start with the other side maybe. Maybe that will help. I really think I should make this a little bit bigger. I think it's not big enough. So uh, what we are going to do is actually make this one one block taller. And then put the roof over here. So yeah, I think that's the better option. So it's still small. But just a little bit bigger. So it's a little bit easier to make. And then we can lift this up. I think that's... A little bit better. I, I want to keep it as small as possible. But it's pretty hard to m design something actually looking pretty good within like what? A, a 5 by 10 or something. <laughs> like it's really small. Uh, but that's the purpose of this video. I just want to make something really small, really cute. Well, basically it is more than so you can really call it cute. But you know what I mean. <laughs> I want a elevated part over here so the idea was like I want some extension like hanging above the ground as some uh, modern houses have so how are we going to do that yeah that's that's all right that's all right so this is what I was actually uh, I've had planned in my head uh, to make like a sort of elevation over here which you can s extend like this and then uh, you can put chests and stuff like that in there and now it gives like an effect as if um, as if this is just a, f a floating part of the house which is actually pretty cool uh, yeah I, I like that it's not bad it's not bad but something is missing so this is uh, like what 10 minutes later and I still don't know how to fix this place i've uh, this is harder this you know this is harder than actually building a big house like that over there behind me because for some reason it, it doesn't really add up or i don't know it doesn't click in my head i like it i like it but it's something something is missing and i don't know what well maybe this will work and we can maybe do also this and then connect these. I think that's not a bad idea. So then, yeah, that's okay. That's yeah, 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 yeah. I feel it, I feel it. All right, so if we do this, oh, that's at least this part done and we will put glass in here yes finally finally that looks way better so now i don't really have to oh wait i will pick this up so now i don't have to go with the white up to the top because then it looks pretty weird so i actually like this this is actually pretty cool i why didn't i came up with this earlier i f for real i have been building for what uh about 20 20 to 30 minutes for just these few blocks how insane is that that never happens i i would have built like half a house already within this time and i cannot even make a tiny house <laughs> not even the front i have only the front uh, done oh whoa, that was close i, I, I i'm losing it guys <laughs> i'm losing my touch that's not <laughs> not really good okay but let, let's keep going maybe i will get better so now we have moss uh tiles right we have moss yeah here moss carpet that's actually pretty cool because if it's right and this is a block we can actually put some we can make the whole floor of the whole ceiling out of that's actually pretty cool let's let's try that like yeah, 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 like an economical house, an eco house. 
<laughs> I'm really enjoying this. This is actually pretty cool. I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm liking it. Oh yeah, and don't worry, we will do the inside because I really want to make it actually livable. Otherwise, you just have a miniature, miniature house for nothing. So I hope you guys can actually follow it because it's really easy. Just it is three tall um, in four blocks. So one, two and three actually four blocks actually uh, four blocks for this level and then one half slab more for white parts and it is one two three four five six seven white on uh, the left side and one two three four white on the right side for the steep slate tiles and then some extra additional slabs and some wood so I think just by looking at this, you should be able to re replicate this if you want to make this yourself. I actually think if I ever start a, a little survival uh, game, something, this is actually pretty cool. Just your starter home. How cool is that? That would actually be really, really awesome. I want to make the back uh, nice as well. So I think I won't just go all across with this and stop over here and see does that look good yeah actually that's not bad so what about this part then we have now done this part let's let's actually fill in the roof now that is done let's see what we can actually do with this part of the house because i don't want to just like make one big wall but who knows, maybe that looks... <laughs> it's actually not bad. <laughs> we can make a back door if we want. Like, we can make a little door at the back. So we have a little, like, miniature garden. That would be actually pretty cool as well. We could, we could do that pretty easily, actually. We can just make a little uh, overhang over here, I guess. Take this away. Hmm. I don't know if I like that. All right, this looks actually pretty cool. So I've done the back side. I just made some windows over here. I went one in. Oh wait, I should I should actually make a tutorial out of, out of this. So if you can remember when we left over here, so it's just two blocks. Actually, these are half slabs. These as well. So it's uh, just a block. Oh, actually, this is a block. Sorry. So it's as I said, one, two, three, four high. It's one, uh, two across, and then one, two, three, four, four blocks, and then go in one by one, and then one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven, and then you end up on this side again. And you should be able to recreate this just by this and otherwise if you just change it bit, uh, by one block that's not really that uh, big of a deal like it's basically the same this entrance is actually way too big in comparison with the entrance in the front because that's just literally one block so we should do that too over here i think so now we can go in and we also need to go out, so we need a trapdoor and also a trapdoor over here so we can easily crawl out and crawl back in. I just want to make it cozy and livable as in as if this is your first starter base so the high end stuff like a anvil or a uh, enchanting table is something that we leave out of this for now I think so let's first put a floor in here and if you watch my videos you guys should know what I'm about to do it's beehive time because beehives that's the fun thing about this you can make them you can give them give a nice pattern a floor pattern I, I really like this I really like this uh, pattern so yeah I will fill this whole place in so there we are, the floor is done and it looks really nice. It, it, it actually looks already pretty great on its own, just empty. But I want to make it at least a bit useful because right now it's just an empty, empty house. So yeah, let's, some, let's put some chests in here and see what we can do. 
So first of all we need a bedroom. I think that's pretty important. So let's... Well, what would be a great place? Now I wonder if you wake up wait do you wake up inside of this glass if so then yeah we have a we have a problem but i think this should be fine actually so let's yeah let's keep this here now we can put a chest over here so you can like store your most important items over here so maybe if uh, in the early stages of the game you may be able to get an anvil if you are uh, well lucky enough to farm enough iron so let's see where should we do that we also have some room over here on the top and we can actually make a little bit of a stair so we have a little stairway over here now we can actually not go uh, up oh we can we can we can go up okay okay that's nice so we can actually use this this place that's actually pretty cool i didn't think of that wait then we also can if we have some some iron bars maybe like if you yeah look at that now we have a little bit of a little uh, space over here to work at which is actually pretty nice so maybe we can put an anvil over here like the, an anvil station over here and then maybe a chest an extra chest or something oh. so we have an anvil and a chest and yeah actually not really much more needed over here we need to cook of course and I think the best thing to do is just some furnaces uh, I could make like a small uh, kitchen maybe that's pretty cool to do let's see if I can actually fit it in so I created a little kitchen <laughs> which is really cool so I use some carpet and carpet on top to get like a shelf idea idea and I yeah I don't know maybe some kind of um, yeah what do you call this thing like a, f a s vacuum a, a smoke vacuum or something you know like uh, yeah you, you probably know what I mean I just don't know what it is called in English so now we have basically the most of the kitchen but we still have some like other tables like a geoffrey wait a cartography ta cartography table what is it called cartography table yeah sometimes my english just leaves my body and i can't really talk anymore and i don't know what it is it's probably late and then i i'm not able to <laughs> properly properly speak but yeah so i hope you can <laughs> i hope you can forgive me uh it's pretty hard to speak english if you if that isn't your native language so i hope i do i do a great job <laughs> I do think we need a jukebox, so <laughs> just a, a nice mu uh, juke jukebox over here. And we also have some other things like a, um, a stone cutter and we have a grindstone that we can use. Maybe you should um, bring those two up here. They, they are more suited here, I think. So let's see, if I do this, can we... Yeah, we can all, all of three we can use. That's actually pretty nice. Cartography table over here. And we will play some chests over there. So let's pick some chests and like, yes, this is actually great. We can actually put one more. Yeah, they can open. So now we have a lot of space uh, to store items. We have basically all the items or tables you need to make stuff. And one of the obvious things I just completely forgot, which is the most important thing all out of all items in Minecraft, which is, if I can actually find it, <laughs> a crafting table. Without a crafting table, you can't craft, which is so logical. Why didn't I get it in this house so now it's in you you can actually create your stuff and i want to decorate it a little bit as well so let's put some lights in and some nice flowers and greenery oh look at this oh that's actually awesome look at that 
see the lighting and stuff that's actually pretty that's pretty awesome and just re just to remind you this house is just what five by ten or something sorry it's it's 10 by 15 so it's 10 in in it's 10 wide and 15 long it's really really small to have such, uh, so much detail in such a small house that's awesome actually i'm really proud of this i don't know what to say i'm really proud of myself and you know i like my own building sometimes because yeah i created it and i put a lot of time in it but for a small build it's actually pretty cool and i'm really happy so let's go out i put some bushes around like here in the front and here down here and i put some over here and here that looks actually pretty cool maybe like this yeah that's that's actually yeah 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 i like it i like it i really like it oh by the way we should make a pathway we should make a pathway so maybe just a uh, concrete yeah that's fine that that looks actually pretty good i think we are done this looks absolutely awesome i'm so glad just by something so small how cool is that how cool can you <laughs> Actually, to be honest, this house looks better than uh, my previous builds. Even though my previous builds are bigger, this looks really cool. And maybe I will make a really big version out of this, but just see how big I am in comparison to the, uh, the front door. Like, it's not even too high, like uh, two stories high. It's really cool just how small this build is and still so useful because let's just have a tour tour around this house it actually uses glass so it's not just fake fake windows it's actually a window we can go in and when you come in you have space to walk it's not too uh, too small it's also not too too big and we have a lot of storage we have all the uh, crafting tables and uh, utilities we need we even have a jukebox for some music we have a nice kitchen where we can uh, just cook our food whatever we want we have a bed we have some storage and up here we have some more some more bits and bobs that we need so you can basically do everything in just a really small house and i'm i'm really happy about it it's really cool and i hope you guys liked it too so so I hope you guys liked it too. It's a small video, I know. It's nothing really special. I just wanted to make something fun and try something new. So as uh, as I said uh, before in the beginning of this video, yeah, I was busy with uh, installing my new computer. So this is the first ever time that I record a video on the new computer. That's why I am actually not really able to make really big things and make big videos. Uh, that's why I did this. But if you are... Uh, here at the end of the video then thank you thank you for watching thank you that you actually came this far if you want to see more of these kind of videos maybe uh, more of these tiny houses or you want to see some other houses well keep watching subscribe uh, hit that like button because without that you won't be notified whenever i create something new uh, which you can probably like and i hope i give you some inspiration if you build this in your own world let me know that's pretty cool pretty cool to see that some people actually use my uh my designs that's really awesome to see i really am glad to have a great community already even though my channel is pretty small it's really awesome to see that we uh, actually have a really great community and that you guys like my video so thank you thank you for watching and i see you guys in the next video